G'day guys, what's cracking tonight? I want to, tonight, it is the night. And I want to tell you about 10 non-photographic pieces of equipment that every photographer should take with them. And I'm not going to give you an intro, I'm just going to jump straight in. In no particular order, here they are. Gaffer tape. Gaffer tape, so this comes in a big thick, thick roll and I just got a saw and tum, straight through the middle of it and nice and handy, right? This comes in handy in a bun bunch of ways. For example, if you've been watching my recent vlogs, you would have noticed that I'm vlogging on the Nikon ZFC, which I'm currently filming on right now. And on the side, it has these little uh, cable, like um, strap duvalackies that and if it was driving you crazy, it was driving me more crazy. And so I've solved the problem with some gaff tape. I've just stuck them down and there's no more gaff tape. What? Shower cap. Shower cap. If it's raining or drizzly and you need to cover your camera body and camera lens with something that's quick and easy but waterproof, shower cap. Get a shower cap from the Lotus Hotel. So where to go? This is a little, little gem. GPS tracker. What? High tech or what? This is what's known as a Bluetooth GPS tracker and I put it in my camera bag. So if nobody knows this either. So don't tell anyone, especially not any thieves. Okay? Serious. Okay. I stash this in the bag and it's um, it's one of those uh, Bluetooth things so it works off everybody else's Bluetooth so you've got to be wary about whether that's something you want to do or not but it enables my stuff if it ever gets pinched if my bag ever gets pinched this is sitting in the bottom where they're never going to check and ding 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 jackpot headphones headphones Gosh, the number of long shoots I've been on where headphones have saved the day and saved my sanity. I listen to a lot of audiobooks, and as a result, Sound Pete's have sent me these headphones. And so I'm going to do a review of these shortly, maybe tomorrow, maybe the next day, maybe the day after that, that you can uh, actually see if these uh, reasonably priced are ones that you might want to get. But regardless, you want to get headphones, a thumb drive. You know when you go shooting with mates and someone takes a photo and they want to transfer it to you and they have their computer and you don't or you take a photo and you want to give them a f just have one of these on hand it's a game changer like take your pick whether it's a six gig or a 600 gig it doesn't matter but um but have one of these handy and um it's it just it just makes such a difference in those jams that you don't predict but when you're there saves the day power packs power packs this is what's known as a big one. This is not so big. Aren't you glad you tuned in? I take this smaller one with me. The links will be in the description for this stuff so you can just see the ampage on it. But I take this with me when I travel, when I go on a trip, and I take with me a cable, which I'll talk about in a sec. And this one I have when I go on holidays or I travel. So this is sort of day pack, this is week pack. And both of these, I think, um, are made by Anchor? Anchor. Anchor. And they, um, they've got a USB here and a USB-C. You can charge them into the wall and then you can plug stuff into them and charge. These things are lifesavers. Cable, let's talk about cable. This is a USB-C cable and I would recommend these. However, what I really wanted to show you but I haven't got it yet because got one of mine got stolen the other day and it didn't have a GPS tracker attached to it. Yeah, I can hear you now. And the new one hasn't arrived but you can get a three-way. And so what happens is it's USB on one, and on the other end, it's Lightning, USB-C, and micro HDMI. And you just use it for powering up things. So you plug this into your power bank, and it charges all your devices, regardless of what they are, right? Epic. Don't use it for data transfer. They don't work. If you want data transfer, just take with you a USB-C. Now, you'll notice this little thing waving around. This thing is really handy because you just wrap your cable up with them. You gotta do it the other way though. <laughs> do it the other way and it works. 
they come in stacks like this they're super cheap again link in the description but these things are great for keeping your cables under control you know cables are just like yeah party in the camera bag and they take on a life of their own and it drives you mental so velcro straps for the cables that leaves two items silver sharpie pen what this is fun because you can just draw all over your camera gear i know you're like what are you doing so a couple of tips you can put a number on your battery so you know the series in which you're using your battery so you don't want to use battery one battery two battery one battery two and then battery three you go one two three one two three as you go through the batteries stick a number one on it you can put a mark so you know exactly where the battery should fit into the camera on your lens caps you can write the millimetage of the actual lens so that you know when you're changing lenses and you've got a million lens caps in front of you if you've marked them off at the end of the shoot you can just and put them all right again on where they should belong final piece space pen this pen is called a space pen because it's the same pen that astronauts use when they go into space and it's waterproof so you can draw on anything at any time as long as there's ink in the chamber and look out like so it's a, a fully fledged pen and then look how small it goes what again links in the description these things are amazing and you feel kind of like a super spy you have one of these stashed in your bag because mark my words there'll be times when you need a pen potentially some paper too maybe i could have some paper here <laughs> So a pen, stick this in your bag, you can't go wrong. These 10 easy, considerably cheap and affordable things are well worth having in your bag. They've got nothing to do with photography. However, if you're a photographer, you will absolutely make use of them. Thanks for watching everyone. Please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. It's a bit wild tonight, isn't it? Do you like the new setup? Yeah. I just did the lounge room about 11 o'clock at night. Come on. Thanks.